Well, good evening, good evening, friends of the internet. It's that time of the week again. You're all live at Suarez HQ in utterly sweltering temperatures. But we don't care. Of course we don't, because we're here for you guys. We're going to have part two of what's going on behind me. I can't wait. It's going to be epic. Who on earth knows what's going to happen? But for now, let's run VT. Yay! Three, two, one. We're back in the room. I've got an itch right at the top of my nose. Ah, the perils of live TV and live broadcasting. Anyway, how are we all doing? I hope you're well. We're going to say hello to everybody in just a minute. But now I just want to tell you, give you a quick walk around what's going on. So we know actually, just, oh, sorry, corner cam is a okay. So let's do a systems check as we walk around. Let's go, PTZ. Low, 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 low. Here we go. Can you see me? Yes, you can. Now you see me. Now you don't. Oosh. Now let's go around here and check on overhead cam, see what's going down. Overhead cam, can you see me? <laughs> yes. Here I am. I'm not sure I can get up now. Help. I'm only joking. Right. Okay. That's that working. And finally, finally, Esther everybody's favorite it's remote cam yay look at that we're going to be moving around 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 instagram meet youtube youtube meet instagram shake of hands charlie good show fantastico oh we love technology while we're on chess cam let's give you a little wander around show you what's happening now did you see last week i hope you did we broke some ground with the world's first suspended space hopper Machine contraption painting, wow, did it come out amazingly well. Stick around, because we're hopefully going to show you that in a little while. It's out in the gallery. But for now, um, actually, that's the space hopper we used last week. Mm, nice, shiny, unbelievably still flexible, yet it's covered with enamel paint. Amazing bit of physics going on there. But you might notice that this poor chap... Looks a little bit deflated. What's wrong, me old mate? What's wrong, son? You've still got a bit of a smile on the back. I'm not surprised you look like that. Oh, dear. Well, you may like to know this is filled with water. But that's for a very good reason. We... <laughs> Say what? We needed to try and uh, make the base of it more of an ovoid shape as opposed to a round. As you can see from the bottom there, the... Uh, the bottom there has got quite a wide circumference and actually it's quite a shallow angle from the sides down to the bottom but we need it to be more acute so we modify modified it for this week that's what we're going to go for i hope that's uh, quite clear so hopefully the paint will run down quicker and it'll actually form at the bottom into a drip that's the hope instagram i'm going to bring you guys up because you've been patiently waiting hello rochelle uh we'll do some shout outs in a minute that actually if you don't mind going on to chess cam just once more buddy sorry mobile cam remote cams down here look we've got a contraption then if i can show you inside there's a hole in the bottom so we might if you if you're all good actually stick that let's see if i can show you what that is because we're about to start painting there we go look so it's a little device we put together where i could pour paint in it's got a single hole in the bottom there we go look so hope for hopefully with that hole in the bottom, we'll have a whole lot of fun. <laughs> I'm here all week. Um, you can rent me. Did you know that? <laughs> oh, I love it. So, yes, we might even hook that on. Very, very simple. I might start pulling paint through that. So don't go anywhere, guys. I've got a feeling this is going to be pretty epic, as it always is. Now, Insta, let's pop you guys over there. We can see our friend, obviously deflated over there. We'll pop, I think, uh, roaming cam. We'll pop that down there. Is that all right, dude? We've got a reasonable shot there. 
Right. Oh, my mic's fell off. Sorry. Right. Let's uh, sort that out. Uh, can you still hear me? Oh, no, I've gone red. I've gone red. Right. Change of battery. Change of battery. Uh, uh, whoa. Right. Just bear with me, everybody. My comms has gone red to 80. Why is that? I can hear him okay. Why is it gone red? Just a low battery. That's it. Yeah, okay. Right. Can you hear me? Yes, I've got you. Have you got me? I've got you, buddy. Yes, loud good. and proud. Loud and proud. Very good. Right. Go to okay. work. Okay. Don't go to work. <laughs> Right, so guys, let's do some shout outs and we'll get on and do some painting. Right, I've got to itch my nose. I'm so sorry. Uh, oh, oh there, are, there are very few pleasures as good as scratching an itch. Right, let's go from the top. Let's go out on YouTube and find out who we got in the room. Juarez is here. Yes, hello. Zane says, good day. Uh, Andy Hill, Nancy Stone. Thank you, Nancy, for your email earlier. Oh, yeah, I really appreciate it. I'll get back to you. Uh, the Rita says hello, Jonas Shearer does, and Mark Begby does. Empty Pallet, good evening everyone, has also joined us, as has Denise Weeks. And Nelson from Boa Tarde, from Brazil. Is that hello, is it? Uh, Nelson, hello Suarez, we're always honoring your wonderful work from Sao Paulo in Brazil. Thank you, Nelson, much appreciated. Luke Bo is also here, good evening, Luke. Very nice to hear. And Terry Staniford from uh, Oregon. Whoa, what's the weather like in Oregon? Let me tell you now, as he walks over to Instagram, I can tell you the weather here is hot. It's hot, 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 hot. Uh, Rochelle says, hope you're both well over on Instagram. Yes, we are. Thank you very much. Uh, block art by Linda Matt to McDonald has also joined us. I can't even pronounce that. Uh, Crazy Horse Concept, Angel Morales, Anastasia, uh, The Dudester. Wow, this is great. Thank you so much for joining us, everybody. Hopefully, we're going to have a real memorable one this evening. Let's just pop you guys down there. Uh, oh, he said good afternoon, did Nelson. Excellent. Good afternoon to you as well, Nelson. Uh, Dana, but no, Dana Butler's just joined us. Hello, everyone. Fantastic. Oh, this is fun. This is brilliant. Okay, happy days. Oh, with the Rita, have you done any space hopper practice during the past week? No. No, all we've got is Mr. Saggy Droopy. <laughs> so we're going to have a second go tonight. Now, I'll uh, I'll tell you, we've made a couple of modifications. We've shortened the canvas. And actually here, look, if you can see what I'm stepping on now, this is the uh, overrun. So actually when I've finished manoeuvring paint, and I don't want it to paint anymore, I can bring it out onto this canvas and it'll collect on here without affecting what we're doing on the main canvas, which you might like to know, I have already base coated and uh, it's still wet, uh, but it is starting to go off. So this is what we're going to be doing this evening, my friends, and we're going to be going back and forwards and we're going to go left and right, similar thing to last week, but we're going to hopefully modify it uh, and see what comes out. Now, must also say a special hello as I put some thinners on this um, to a, uh, our new client, Anne. You may know we've mentioned her before. She likes to uh, watch from the hot tub. Well, there's nothing like this evening in 30 degree heat to be out in a hot tub. So, Anne, if you're watching, hello. And a specific mention this evening because she's purchased two originals that uh, she commissioned. And uh, we were there yesterday, hanging them personally on the wall. And Anne even made us some lemon drizzle cake, which was delicious. So we definitely said we'd give her a a shout out uh, tonight so thank you Anne, uh, and thank you for all your uh, your kind support as well we really appreciate it okay so we've just sprayed that with a little drop of thinners and uh, i think now we're about ready to get going uh, guna 6699 hughes electrical uh right uh, ryu house oh our uh, ryu house of art got there in the end <laughs> so i could not read that and who's that guitar Oh, my eyes are going funny. Guitar. Uh, uh, oh, gold tax art. Is that? Sorry, my eyes have gone a bit funny. Oh, and Diana West. Hello, Diana. Very nice to see you here this evening. Right. Okay, so, got my thumbs up. Great. Let's get some paint on. That's it. Hughes Electrical Laguna 6699. Hopefully, I haven't missed anybody. Right. Okay, who's up for a drop of yellow first? Shall we just... Shall we just... 
do? Should we just do it? What do you think? Should we get some yellow on? Shall we do it? Are we ready, everyone? Here we go. Here we go. Do it! Just do it! Yesterday, you said tomorrow. So just do it! Make your dreams come true! Nothing is impossible! No! What are you waiting for? Do it! Just do it! Yes, you can! Here we go, everybody. The first pause. They're going on. What's going to happen? Let's see. Oh, well, we've definitely got a tail. That's what we wanted. That's what we wanted. So something is definitely happening. All right, let's get some more on because that's just coated the hopper now. I've got to try and figure out where, where do I actually put the paint? Uh, right, okay. It's all, it's all going to get very real very, very quickly. Uh, Discovery Channel, if you're watching, this is the future. Shark week? Nah. Paint week. That's what you want. Let's see if we can get some moving on that. Okay, that's more like it. Yes, now we're getting the tails happening. So let's get this evenly distributed. And now, if I have to leave the hopper, of course, I can move it to the safe zone. Ooh, the happy place. I can move it to the happy place. There we go. Let's send that all the way back. And let's see what happens now. Again, if I'm not happy with these things, or the way it's working out, I can change to my other hopper. Uh, hopper as in something you, you will hop like a grain hopper, rather than a space hopper. So let's go backwards and forwards. Here we go. We're getting some thin tails on there. Back we go into the safe zone. Yes, I'm happy with that. Right, let's get our next colour on. Let's see what, where, we go. Where, are we, where are we going to go next? Ooh, I think some blue. Who's up for a drop of blue? Now, this one is a little bit more liquid, so I'm going to start it here. And we're going to send it flying. I hope you're all ready. I hope you can all see this. Here we go. Here we go. Right, in goes the blue. It's going everywhere. Oh, it's going everywhere. It's going everywhere. Here it goes. Look, you don't want to miss this. Let's pick up the cam. Oh, pick up the cam. Can, it, can I capture it? Can I capture it? Here we go, guys. Look at that. There's your camera shot. Backwards and forwards we go. Yes. Where's it going to stop? Where does it ever end? I don't know, but this is good. Sorry, Instagram. I nearly knocked you over. The excitement is almost too much. Oh. Well, if I wasn't warm already, I sure on earth am now. Right. Okay. That's blue. Now, remember, this is what we're concentrating on. Well, let's pop roaming cam. Is that okay, buddy? Can we see that? So, Kirsty Bo is also here. Good evening, Kirsty. And Deb is also here. And Denise Weeks. How did the resin piece turn out? Ooh. It is still drying, would you believe? I'm not kidding you. We will release that at some point, but we're still trying to figure out how to get it to dry. I know that might sound an absolute crazy thing to say, but it's madness. We literally can't get it to dry. So this combination of materials is really causing us a bit of grief at the moment. Oh dear, oh dear. What do you do, eh? Yes, yeah, thank you for inquiring. We will get to that at some point. Right, my friends. Let's show you what's up next. Can I get a... Ooh. Now, that is a particularly nice colour. For the technical amongst you, it's RAL4010, which is tele called Telemagenta. I've got a very itchy back. I'm so sorry. Uh, <laughs> my back's been itching all day long. It was off. Right, okay. Let's get some pink on. Let's try and find out how I'm going to do this and where it's going to go. Right, I think I need to do it in the safe zone. Right, so Denise, yeah, put it in the sun to bake it. It's already been out there literally since the day we pulled it out of here. It's been in 50 degree heat in the studio and it's still not set. So I think it's just a chemical thing now. It is not going to set. So we're going to have to try and figure out a way to hopefully put resin back over the top in these certain places so that we can almost seal it. You know, but there is a potential that we, it'll never be, it'll never be sealed. So I don't know. We're um, This is what happens when we're... When we're really pushing the boundaries of our material technology, this is what happens. We're, we're going to come up against these issues. Right, so I'm just going to leave that there a second and see what I can dribble on. Now, what's interesting down underneath 
because it is actually forming closer together the clumps but it's still not at a single point so there will be some modification to this guys and we will then re redo this at another point in time i think we'll change it over for next week but yeah we'll definitely have to do some modification to it and it's got a lot of water in it if i do this there you go look you see well look at that oh, 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 oh that maybe that's what i should have done from the start mate look at that we, uh, we plough the fields and scatter the good seed of the land. Now I'm just waiting for that to uh, go pop and all the water go all over that painting. Because that is full of water and, and Ed's swinging that around like he doesn't care. Like he hasn't got a care in the world. <laughs> but that is full with about <laughs> three gallons of water. <laughs> Yeah, I love it. Love it. I haven't got... I don't care what... You know, you can't afford to care, can you, when you're doing this kind of thing. Right, okay. Good so far. Who's going to shout me a colour? Anytime you're ready. Roll up, roll up. Shout me a colour. Cry me a river. Hello, Artfish42. Did you say Sherry's here as well? Sherry, hello, Sherry. Did the space space opera deflate? No, Sherry. Let me show you the difference. Look, I don't know which cameras we're on, but I'm going to pop this under here. Look, there we go. Instagram. Look, everybody. So inflated and deflated. So we've used the second one and deliberately deflated it this week. You can see the difference between the two. It's just to try and allow the paint to go to more of a point. So what we're having to do is kind of experiment with different shapes and. You know, that kind of thing to see what's going to work and what doesn't. So that's kind of where we're at at the moment. Right, okay. Okay. Mm. Two for orange. We've got two votes for orange. Let's have a look on Instagram. Is who you vote, what you're voting for. So we've got two for orange. One for red as he reached for the red paint. What do we reckon there, guys? Anki Bop has joined. Merit. Uh, Amelia one has and uh, I can't read that you what what no can't read it uh, but anyway thank you for joining us <laughs> all right okay let's go I'll tell you what we'll go for a drop of yeah don't thank you but right let's go for a drop of red and we'll go for a drop of orange as well I think that'll look quite nice now the orange the 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 orange is very liquid so I've got to be quite careful with that and I'm going to mix it in this one with the white a little bit, even though there's a drop of white down below already. So let's see. I'm not going to go too mad with this. But here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put streaks of red in it as well. So we're going red, orange, and white. What's going to happen now? Oh, my word, Ed. Let's push this around. Let's see what's going to happen. Here we go. So we're back. We're back in the end zone. The NFL fans amongst you. Terry Stanford. Yeah, I thought it was going to be hopping on it. Not a chance. That's what you want. You really you want me to get on it, don't you? There we go. That's interesting now. Now we start. This is so much different from last week, look. So it is making a difference. It is making a bit a difference. I tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna get some more on there. I'm loving this. I'm loving it. Let's get it on. Let's get it on. Look. Here we go. Where else can you see this on the internet? You can't. It's because we're nuts and we're crazy. We're not really, we love it. Let's Nowhere. get it on. Can't see this anywhere, you're right. Anywhere on the internet. It's 35 degrees here where we've had a right day of it. But we're here doing it all over again, pushing back the frontiers, live in front of you. Love it, absolutely love it. It's looking like poppies in a on rapeseed oil in a field. I love it. We need to get some green in, don't we? Yeah, just some hints of green in there. <laughs> so Sherry7100 says purple. He's obviously having an AD moment there. Excellent. That's what we like. I'm sure he'll be very purple. Happy about that. Purple. Right. So I'm just going to change purple. gloves, everybody. Instagram, I'll give you a move around. Let's just tell you what we did today while I'm changing the gloves. Insta, let's move you guys just round here a little bit so we can give you a slightly different angle. So today we, uh, we've been over to Milton Keynes. If you've uh, been keeping an eye on social media, you'll see that we've been doing a big block, a big resin block, 
with 300 individually cut pieces in it. It's for a project we've been working on for two years. Can't tell you any more than that. So we've done a two-hour drive each way to Milton Keynes. We've also stopped at Byberry Trout Farm, which Ada's going to pop on the screen now, because those amazing people there have got our five-foot-tall kingfisher, which we're just going to put on screen now. Sorry, Instagram, you can't see that. Uh, but if you uh, do go back through the timeline at some point in time, you'll see the five-foot-tall kingfisher, which is just about to hit the vlogs in the next couple of weeks as to how we did it. But you should see on your screen just how awesome that is. And we've finally been to see it today. And our lovely friends at Bybury Trout Farm, uh, established since 1902, an amazing place to go and visit. Are utterly stunning in the, one of the most beautiful parts of the Cotswolds. Uh, have been very, very kind and good to us today. And they fed and watered us and uh, treated us like kings. It's been amazing. So thank you guys if you are watching this evening. So yeah, we've been done that. We've been in the car for five hours. We've done hundreds of miles and we've raced back here into the, well, what is currently 35 degree heat. To answer your question, Funny Fox, good evening. Thank you for joining us. And uh, so in the US, you want that in Fahrenheit? Well, I can tell you 50 is 120. So it hit 50 in here the last couple of days. Uh, so yeah, so we had it 120 degrees in here. In fact, it will have been more than 120 degrees because the thermometer uh, times A just goes completely, the screen just goes black whenever it gets to 50 degrees. So at the moment in Fahrenheit, AD is currently working in 95 degree heat in Fahrenheit, just to give you an idea, okay? Yeah, just to kind of let you know, uh, I have wet ears. I'm wearing headphones, which I have to do, and my ears are, are wet, and I think I'm not actually going to be able to get out of this chair because I'm stuck to it. Yeah, ju just for everybody's benefit, I mean, he is, he is okay. He's always got wet ears. Wet ears and a wet nose. Oi. <laughs> uh, no, bless him. He's, uh, he's very hot out there. I do have a little bit of airflow in here, admittedly. Not a lot. Uh, but it's okay, you know, we're pressed on, we're okay. We wouldn't do it if it was uh, if it was that bad. So, you know, yes, it's hot, but you kind of get used to it after a while. Right, okay, I see we've had some votes for green. Let's get the green out, because we do need a little green. So going in with a lime green, and we're going to thin that down just a little bit. So we're on remote cam now. So you can just see that nicely developing on the floor. Now I've got some really, really interesting uh, things happening. Oh, which camera have we lost? Oh no, we've lost remote cam. Uh oh. So back on quarter cam. Sorry, YouTube. Down to three cameras. It must be the heat. Uh, the heat's been knocking all kinds of things out today, honestly. Right, okay, moving swiftly on. So we got colour, we got colour, we got colour. Isn't that marvellous? Let's do some green. I think we'll apply here and we'll send this on a goose chase and see how we get on. Right, okay. Um, before I do that, dude, do you need any help with the chest cam? Sorry, with Rome cam to get it back online? Right, okay. We, we, we've got to figure out that camera. Yeah, mate, I'm just going to go very quickly over it. Just needs a little soups on a green, nothing major. There we go, that's all we need, that's why I've let most of it go on. Ada was just saying, oh, it's too loose, it's too loose. Yeah, it's just because I want a little soups on. I don't want a lot, just need a little, you know, little greenery in there. This is our tropical garden, our lovely little paradise, now it can come off. Great having this runoff area, I love that. Absolutely love that. Right, okay, that's cool. So, let's see if we can uh, sort out why we don't have Rome cam. So, a, he's got no signal coming in, so let me just see now what's going on. Okay, I've got a green light here, but no orange light. No, it switched itself off, mate, so I'm going to switch it back on again. I don't know why. No, that battery's completely... No, battery's back on. Okay, I don't know why that switched itself off. It must be the heat. Right, sorry about that, everyone. So we're going to try and reactivate... We're going to reactivate the camera. So screen. We're back on. We're back on. Happy days. Right, Insta. Let's move you guys around here. Let's give you a different view of what's going on. Let's move it to the back here. No, it's lost it again. Yeah, it's gone off, mate. Must be the heat. Must be the heat. 
Oh, darn it. Sorry, everybody. Right, that's better, Instagram. Okay. No. Yeah, I'll put it in front of the fan just for 10 minutes and see if we get any joy. Make the battery side. There we go. So I'm in front of the fan. <laughs> that's right. That's right on it now, dude. So that's good. Oh, so we're going to try and cool the equipment down. We had a... It, <laughs> We've got a 4K camera. Um, I don't even know if I can show you on my phone. Shall I show you on my phone? This this will be fun. Right, Insta. This is um, this is camera equipment. Right. Tell me if you can see that, buddy. Now, there's there's his lordship. Look, watch what happens. So he switches it on, and the head is okay. And then watch what happens. He switches it back off again. And this is what the heat does. Honestly, this is worth watching. Check it out. Ready? Oh, hey, what? Look. <laughs> That's what the head is just supposed to align itself forward. And it was like, whoa, it's having a proper freak out because of the heat. And this is an, ex an expensive 4K camera. Look at that. Yeah, so that's my uh, Pocket 2 that I use to do the vlogging, and it just overheated. And that's what happens when it over overheats, and it took forever to cool it back down again. And that, it just it just wouldn't stop, and it kept doing it all day. So it looks like we've lost the Sony camera as well to heat, unfortunately. All these things, they, they, they run hot, and they'll just stop, unfortunately. Right. So, yes, it's not just the squidgy organic life forms that are struggling with the heat. Although, actually, I'm, I mean, I'm all right. I think we're, we're both actually doing OK, remarkably, considering it's so hot. Um, OK, Rooney Frankie joined over on Instagram. Hello, GM Siga. Hey, uh, Pat Nelson. Hello, Pat. It's lovely to see you. I've just waved at Virtuosity, uh, Fake Art Gallery, Mrs. Gull of the World. Novo Vum. The old zoo. Oh my word. Hello, the old zoo. Uh guys, it's very nice to see you here. Um I almost booked a room at the old stores hotel the other day. You'll you'll know what I mean. No one else will. Uh great to see you here. Thank you so much. Right. Um your art is too hot to handle. Well, you're very kind. Thank you very much. <laughs> right. Uh thank you, Barrett. That's very kind of you. Uh saying it's looking good. Well, we're definitely making some inroads over the one we did last week, which is good. So what I've done just over on Instagram, you can just see down here, guys, this is the runoff area. You can see this little bit of the floor that's left here. So I'll just ignore this bit here. This is what we're concentrating on. We're going to give you a proper look at that in just a moment. Now, here's the reason why I said it was important to remember about that it's base coated, because everything that's going on down here is now mixing with a white coat that was put on before we came on air. So it's not going on to just the, the virgin canvas. This is onto a piece of coated canvas but it's one that hasn't had a time to dry. So everything's going to mix with the white underneath. It's going to create some amazing effects. I'll tell you what I want to do now. I'm very, very tempted to stick some gold on, and then I might put a little drop of black on because I'm actually really liking the colors on that. That's got some real happy vibes going. So let's reach for the gold because it wouldn't be a live stream without the gold, would it? Now, let's give that a proper shake. I'm going to need to take some fluids in. Just give me a second, everybody. You've got to understand, you know, this physical exertion on the end of a 10 hour day already. It's very, very hot. Of course, I you know I don't want to keep just harping on about how hot it is. But just give me a second, guys, just to uh, just to hydrate. OK. Okay, thanks guys. Right, just going to see if we can reboot the Sony. Screen's going to go blank. Okay, uh, just booted on. Okay, that is now on, buddy. No, dude, it's a bat the battery says it's completely empty. So let's go and get another battery. Right, we think we think we know what it is, guys. The battery's had it. Right, okay, we're getting there. I'm sorry about this, everybody. <laughs> oh, we're dealing with all this on the fly. Yeah, the battery's really unhappy oh it's boiling as well goodness me right uh who else have uh, has has come in oh cameron hello we haven't said hello to cameron uh 
What else? Who, is, who else is here? Just while Aidy's gone to get me another battery. Just talk amongst yourselves, which is your Woody the artist. It's five and quarter show. Hello, Woody. Great to see you. Um, yeah, so Funny Fox, just to answer your question, why is one so floppy? Uh, well, it's it's because we had uh, the other one was very very round, you see, and we couldn't get the paint to form at the bottom. So yeah, where are you, mate? Are you down the side or which way? Oh, thank you. Yeah, got it. Brilliant. Okay, superb. <laughs> I didn't know whether he's coming in through the front or the back. Yeah. Um, so we're just trying to get the paint to form around uh, more like an oval, oven shape than. Uh, in the roundness of the previous one. I hope that answers your question. Right, let's see if we've got full battery on this one. Well, that's never happened before, has it? Oh, right, this is just switched on, buddy. It says it's full battery. Right. Yes, we all good? Hey! Woo <laughs> <laughs> awesome right okay Whew. this is where we're at guys okay so uh we're doing pretty well on the on the catch canvas over there i'm, I'm pleased with that so far and uh, actually developing really nicely down here just need to be a few a few more accent colors in that that's happy isn't it look at that an abstract cottage garden i'm loving it inspired by our visits through the cotswolds this, this afternoon i think that's an apt and fitting uh brief to work to right okay well, let's take our inspiration up a level let's get busy with the gold i think that has to be done right let's do a, a current systems check with uh ad and in control four cams all good at the moment mate are we all good on four cams yeah okay fine fantastic so now i'm just going to mix some gold instagram i'm going to give you a little whiz bang up here onto the mixing desk so you can see Hopefully what's going on. Um, now, can I angle you down a little bit? I can. Uh, kish, kish, kish joined. Uh, Joseph joined. Thank you very much. Lovely to see you guys. So I'm going to move my... There we are. Now you can see how lovely my paint desk is. Okay, got it. Right, let's uh, get ourselves some gold out of there. Okay, so I'm trying to move, move you guys around so you can see what's going on as much as possible. It does get quite difficult to <laughs> try and figure out the best camera angles to give you. Now, can I tell you something pretty awesome about the gold, if you don't know already? I kid you not, this gold is by appointment to Her Majesty the Queen. And there are only two establishments that use this gold in the entire of the United, entirety of the United Kingdom. Uh, one is Her Majesty the Queen at Buckingham Palace, and the other one is here at Suarez Art. I kid you not, by appointment to Her Majesty the Queen. So if you ever drive past Buckingham Palace... And you see all the gates with all the gold, ornate, iron work. It's the same paint as we are just about to put on the painting with a space hopper. So write and tell your majesty, Her Majesty, Hey, Queen Elizabeth, you'll never guess what. These two crazy dudes use your paint. Check it out. Right, are you ready with the gold? Here we go. Oh, that's nice. Is it coming off? Is it starting? Yes, there it is. The streaks of gold like a like a satellite burning through the sky that's nice that's nice actually down this side that looks really good so i think what i'm going to do now it's starting to formulate into drips well, let's see if we can get those snaky branch like structures going off the other side and we'll repeat the pro whoa come back thank you easy tiger oh regal paint his his majesty ed no <laughs> definitely not that is something, but I don't know Majesty. Uh, AD can fill in the blanks. <laughs> Edward, are you using my paint again? <laughs> I should have known. You'd have done an impression of the Queen. You couldn't resist that, could you, mate? Love it. <laughs> okay. Right. Oh, yeah, sorry. <clears throat> Moving on. Right, so we're giving it a bit of a swing now. Let's get the few... Oh, there we go. That's what you've come here for. That's the money shot. Oh, yes. We do one all the way to the end. Right, are you, are you ready for Rome cam, mate? This is it. Oh, sorry, Instagram. I completely forgot you. I'm, do I'm doing all this and you guys can't see because I completely forgot. Right, let's move you up there. We're going to send this all the way to the end. I'm so sorry, everybody. Right, here we go. Here we go. Are we ready? Go. 
Whee! Oh, that was a good one. Round all the way back again. Whee! Skadoosh. I am loving that. Okay. Got some very subtle gold going on there now. Looking pretty amazing. Got to be so, so careful now what goes on next. Just the right amount of green. I think we're up for one more colour, buddy. One more colour. Oh, now this is the crucial bit. What's it going to be? What's it going to be in there? Hmm. What is it going to be? We've got our hybrid of orange and red. So my question to everybody is, what should be my colour now? What's the last thing to come into there? I don't think it needs much more. It's really, really happy. That's a summery meadow. It's beautiful. Something really popping. Oh, dude. Should I go rocket red? What do you think? What do you think? Right, let's show you this on camera for those of you don't know. This is... Oh, the reader says dark. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I'm thinking it might just need a few bit, few drops of black just to give it some uh, little bit of structure. Yeah, let's let's hold the rocket red. Yeah, I, th I was thinking that. Let's go in with the black. Let's do it. Let's do it, man. Ooh, she reminds Sherry of a carnival. Excellent. Right, so Instagram, we're going to get some black on. It's got to be black. Got to be black. Carnival. That's a good title. I'm not sure if I've used that one already, then. Oh, what did the artist? Tangerine. Ooh, nice. Um, oh, no. Um, yes, I must say something, guys. Um, one of our regular viewers and contributors, you all know Ian Holmes. Uh, you must have seen him on chat before. Um, Ian had a nasty bump in the car. Somebody hit him and... Uh, in his car this week i saw it on facebook um so uh, he is okay cars are right off it's shaking him up quite a bit uh, but he is okay so i'm um, sure we can all uh, send our wishes to ian um bless him it's probably why he's not here tonight he's convalescing but uh, ian if you watch this on catch up buddy we, we send you our regards and we, we wish you a speedy recovery okay let's go in with the black we're gonna go in nice and gentle on this because i've got a feeling I'm, i can't can't be too gung-ho on this. We've got a little bit of time before it's coming down. It's coming down there. Our instruments moving. Let's just go nice. Oh, here it is. Here it is. Let's go nice and easy. We're just putting a few hints here and there. Might need a little bit more just to get those lines going, I think, maybe. Yes. Let's get, let's get another layer on. Okay, that's fine so far. I'm happy with that. Let's build this up nicely. This is going to give it a little bit of structure. Let's move that over this way. Is it coming off? Uh, wait for it, wait for it. The right time, yes. So we're moving back and forth. That's not that's not bad. That's not shabby at all. Now, of course, it's going to pick other colours up. Of course it is. So this is going to get a little bit diluted, which, you know, is, is okay. This is just trying to bring some, some other bits and pieces into it. Just one or two one or two darker points which i think is is you're all you're all right guys this is exactly what we needed to do that'll give us a little just a little bit of structure here and there nicely done everybody well done gold stars all around so i'm thinking now should i stop or is there room for one more let's have a good walk around everyone tell you what i'm going to do i'm going to pick up instagram first and yes i am going to go remote cam buddy now, what did Rochelle said? Maybe Carnival Royale. Ooh, very good. Yes, I have used Carnival, says Rochelle. Yes, I thought I had. Quite a while ago, actually. Right, okay, and still, let's, let's point you guys down here. So that's currently where we're at. Okay, so really nice so far. Just don't want to overdo it now. Now, this is the thought, isn't it? Do I just drop some white in now just to try and, you know, maybe, uh, maybe just jazz that up a little bit? It's a tricky one. It's on that ragged edge. What do we all think? What do we think? You're all involved here. Let's pop you guys back down here. Right, let's get you there where you can see everything. And then um, if you can, are we on, uh, which cam are we on, buddy? Let's do remote. Let's have a look. 
So from the top, look, this is where we're at. Let's see if I can show you. So, so far, color separation really nice. I can still see veins of white going on underneath. I just wonder if it just needs that white. Maybe a cream. What do we think, guys? What do we think? Have a look there, look. Let's give you a look from the corner. And um, that's kind of where we're at. It's a very nice so far. Let's go down low, low, low. There we go. So I'm thinking we might need something. It's all blooming very, very nicely. I'm just not entirely sure what. Um, I mean, there is a there is a case for the very bright Piaggio green, but, you know, quite thick in dots, or maybe the rocket red. Let's give you an option here. So rocket red is that. <laughs> oh, get your glass, dark glasses on. <laughs> um, yeah, it's tricky. So what are we saying? A bit more limes. There's Kirsty orange, um, turquoise zane, hmm, white over the blue, another metallic. It's so, so difficult isn't it um i just think that yeah so the other contender if i've got any left um i just don't want to kill it you know what i mean i don't want to kill it it's right on that ragged edge i just don't want to kill it i don't know if i've got any actually that green left i might have used it all in which case that's going to force my hand isn't it or, yeah i think i might have used it all darn it Okay, well that might uh, that might affect my decision somewhat because I haven't got the one I was going to think of using right. Right, so my top candidate at the moment is Rocket Red, our most expensive paint, bar none. <laughs> right, so we're going to pop our own can down there. Okay, uh, right. What's everybody saying? So Judy Fleming, olive green. End section looks like a peacock, yeah. Pearl would be nice, or turquoise, yeah. Another metallic, it is really tricky. <laughs> you see some of these agonizing decisions that, that, that pose themselves when you're doing this kind of thing. Here's an odd thing, right? I even wonder, controversially, whether it needs a very bright pink on it. Rocket red or bright pink. My worry is with the rocket red going on there, it's going to pick up all the other colours and turn like a horrible muddy colour. Mm, I'm going to have a quick think about that. Right, guys, we've got 29 people watching and only 16 thumbs up. What's going on? Remember, give us a thumbs up, guys. Very, very simple to do. You can even do it if you're watching on a big screen TV as well. Hit that thumbs up for us if you're enjoying what you are watching so far. We'd really appreciate it. Helps the channel get seen across the network. And of course, that's what we all want. We want to grow and be prosperous and have lots of people enjoying all the cool things that we're doing here every Wednesday in the 50 degree heat. Also, remember, if you are new here and you don't want to miss anything, please do consider subscribing. Again, that means you'll never miss any of our upcoming videos and click on the bell icon so you get notified about them. Awesome. Thank you very much. And remember, because we've got a couple on here tonight, our patrons get the first exclusive views of everything that we do, particularly all the live stream paintings. And they literally get it the day after, plus a host of other, other benefits for all the new artworks and things that we're getting up to as it happens you can go and check that out guys on patreon.com there's a link down in the description below and if you're watching on instagram you can also find that link in my bio scroll down the page hit it have a look and go from there thank you so much guys brilliant big thumbs up excellent right in goes the rocket red Yeah, Kirsty, I'm thinking about the white. It's it's just, I'm really on that. i tell you what I'm going to do. Um, yeah, I know, Zane, the green. The trouble is with the green, I've got to be very careful on the green because it's going to go very muddy because of the black. So I've kind of hit that point now without changing the hopper, which is going to be almost impossible. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to try a little rocket red, and I'm just going to let it run here, and I'm going to see if I can grab a couple of points left at top and bottom where it actually comes off and doesn't look horrendous. If it does, and that's okay, it's going, it's going, no, that's awesome. Get it on, Ed, get it on. Here we go. I knew it, I knew I could do it. Should have faith in myself. There we go. They're just these tiny little break points. You know, these are, these are our, 
This are our poppy fields. Lovely. Look at that. Now, this is where it comes into its own. I can place these with actually some remarkable degree of accuracy, I'm just finding. The flow rate is just right. I've obviously put just about the right amount on. And the one key thing I'm looking for here is the colour to change. Because if the colour starts changing into black or some dusky colour, then it's coming straight off. But that's not bad. So what I want to do is just in some of the darker areas. There we go. That's nice. I'm leaning on it now. You can take my weight. You can take anything. Just making sure that it's not pulling off anything that's too dark. Here down in the blue. Let's. Yes, that's it. We're doing it. It's lightening up the blue. We're getting all these pops of colour in. Oh, my word. Magnificent. And then some. Happy days. That's what it needed. I mean, if only I'd got the equivalent in a lime green as well. That would be amazing. So I think what we might very well do is uh, try a little drop of white just to finish off. And then, guys, don't go anywhere. Seriously. That's what I want to show you. I want to show you the one we did last week because you aren't going to believe it. So make sure you don't go anywhere because this is the bit you all want to see. Just how awesome it turned out last week. So... We'll go for a drop of white again. Now we've got the safety canvas at one end. I can check to make sure that everything's looking half decent before we go for it on the canvas. I think this is definitely the secret look, because look what we've collected on one end. That was definitely well worth doing. So now, because the white is a different consistency, what I don't want to do, Instagram, I hope you're paying attention, is get something coming off that looks terrible. So again, I'm just going to go to the front and to the back with the white. I'll come around this side for a change. And when this starts to come off, I just need to make sure it's still white. Which it is. Here we go. Here we go. Let's get it on. Yes, nice. That's picking up actually some of the rocket red. Happy days. Don't mind that at all. Lovely. That's going to be nice. I'm going to do the same over this side. So we've got these nice little veins and rivers appearing. Happy days. They'll mix with the... That's going to mix with the gold beautifully. Honestly, it's going to be stunning. Yes, it's coming off. Here we go. Candy store. Love it. Love it. Oh, yes. Oh. Yes, let's bring all the rocket red on. Oh, can you see that? We've got candy canes, everybody. Oh, look at that. AD, your machine is amazing. I love it. Look at that. We're in a candy cane forest. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, yes. That is a complete explosion of joy. It's stopping right there, everybody. That is 100% dud if ever I've seen it. Doesn't need a single thing more on it. Nice. God, you guys are good. You're brilliant. No, you were all... Did you all say Rocket Red? No, of course you didn't. <laughs> but we're all in it together, guys. This looks amazing. I'm so, so happy with it. What a happy thing coming down every morning to see that at your breakfast table. Yes, indeed, he do. Right, okay, I'm happy with that. That's all looking good. Now then, if, I, if I'm really clever, do we think I can actually exit out of here? <laughs> and show you, in the uh, actual gallery, what last week's painting looks like. What do we think? Let's give you a look at this with all the candy canes on it, Instagram. I've got to, I've got to show you guys. Let's go right in there. Can we, can we see this coming out? Look! Oh, it is literally the 4th of July meets Mardi Gras, meets a summer's day in the Cotswolds. That is flowers, it's vegetation, it's happiness, it's joy, it's colour. Oh, I'll wait to show you this one next week. Come out, that's, that's really nice. No chemicals, nothing. This is purely the absolute joy of paint and the fact that we are mad enough to use a deflated space hopper suspended above the canvas. I thank you. Right. So, let's pop you down there. I know I need to grab two, two cameras here, don't I? So stick where you are. Let's see, shall we, if I'm capable <laughs> of doing this out of the gallery, because I want to show you last week's painting. Let's stick that there, shall we? Right, uh, so let's check out in control. Dude, everything all right for my exit out of here? Okay, so we're going to hope that all the uh, audio and video uh, carries on. 
Right, okay, so... Oh, Robert Mungin has just joined us. Uh, a little bit late, Robert. <laughs> um, oh, Sherry7100, what happened to the one colour a week painting? We finished it! Um, I'm not sure we can show you that. I might lose video, but we'll definitely show you that. Yeah, we've taken it out now because I think it's done. So, okay, but thank you. That's a very good question. Right, I'm going to see if I can get out of here. So, hold on to your uh, hollyhocks, everybody. Let's see. I can actually get out of out of here. Ooh, nearly knock a wire over. Right, thanks, buddy. Right, that's three, one. Here we go. We're doing it. We're doing it. Right, we're going out. I've still got my mask on. Are we ready? Are we ready, everybody? I'm going to try and get you both in shot. Here it is. Here it is. We're going to have a look. Here it is. Last week's painting. Da, da, da. There it is, everybody. So, we're in the gallery now. We're looking at last week's painting. How close can I get without losing signal? We're pushing it a little bit. We're okay. Look at that. Let's move around here a little bit. Now, obviously, we have got the lights on, so it's difficult to see. I'm going to get down on my hands and knees here. Let's see if I can show you what's going on. It's really quite difficult. So I'm trying to do this with two cameras. I wish I could photograph this. <laughs> right, I'm kneeling on it now. I'm trying to give you some to like looks at what's going on are we are we getting that on both platforms i hope we are try to go as slow and as delicately as i can without dropping anything this was last week's the very first one we've ever done with an inflatable ball suspended on the machine that AD did and even this <laughs> just i mean it's just so out there i mean, just think it's just wonderful there we go So, Aid is just going to go, don't, yeah, Aid just said in my ear, he's going to go and get the resin one. Oh, that's exciting. Here he comes. Here he comes, everybody. Here he comes out. There he is. Hello, hello. And there he goes. Let's go. He's going to grab the resin one because you asked about it. Now, I don't want to go too far into the gallery because I might lose signal. Um, so, I'm completely blind here. Uh, I don't really know what's happening. <laughs> uh, right, okay. So, let's see. Shall I come this way a little bit? Let's have a little look at the gallery car while we're here. There we go. That's a uh, vacuum chamber for resin. Haven't yet put it away. There we go. You're getting a proper look tonight, aren't you? I'm still in my uh, space mask. There we go. All getting a good look. Here we go. He's got it. He's got it. Right. I'll let him go past and we'll have a proper look. So we're going to lay this down for you. And there it is, everybody. That was about two, three weeks ago. There's the resin painting. We pushed back all the frontiers. We did the things that were impossible. We mixed enamel paint with resin. The two shouldn't mix. In fact, we've got a few areas on this that are completely, they just refuse to dry. Oh, and there's my Instagram gone. Sorry, guys, let me reboot. Uh, the. Sorry, just bear with me now looking at the ceiling. It's always going to happen, wasn't it, one day? Let's just stick that back on again. There we go. Three, two, one. You're back in the room. Right. <laughs> so there we go. Look, that was the resin painting, which we did on the tilt and pan table. And it does look unbelievable. I mean, it just dried superbly well and just came out superbly well. However, we've got small parts of it that refuse to dry. And of course, as soon as we hang it up, all the resin starts to pour out and make some funny shapes. So, of course, we have to be extremely careful on what we do next with it. We've literally just got to seal the whole surface, but of course we've got to be careful because some of the parts of it um, we don't want to put resin on. So we're still trying to figure out how best to do that, but it does look awesome. Thank you, buddy, for bringing that out. That is amazing. Oh, and can I dare I just walk this way? <sighs> See how far I can get before my signal goes. Uh, oh God, no, I can't. I'm going to lose signal. But somewhere over there, Behind all the paint is the one that we do the paint the bit every week on. So it's kind of like all the way in the background behind there. As you can see, there's a lot of stuff. Look, this is how busy we are, guys. We always say we're busy. Look, I'm going to tell you exactly why. We're with a mixture of commissions, things to go on the site. Oh, there's, there's paintings everywhere on the floor. We're literally running out of room everywhere, as you can see. So 
we are we are completely true when we say we are absolutely at capacity but hey you know it's all good it's all good never complain right okay let's go and find uh let's go and find the main man Woo! there we go buddy that's it so let's go back into the pod i hope you've enjoyed your little tour there guys let us know what you think <laughs> there he is with his big great big industrial fan blown to try and keep the poor man cool a bit, I think you see now. Ah. Oh look, it's only it's only 32 degrees now. What? Well, positively cold, mate. Hilly. <laughs> anyway, right, so um if you don't mind, buddy, holding that one. So you're out in control now, you can see exactly what's going on. And uh hopefully hold that one and try and point both. That'll be awesome. Right, so Instagram stay right where you are. Look at that. There's the shot, isn't it? How amazing is that? Right, so guys, that's tonight's live stream. You've seen the painting created, a whole heap of fun, done something completely different from last week. But we've shown you last week, and one before that as well. I think you'll agree. What an amazing night we've had. But we are going to leave it there. I'm now not in front of all the comments, although actually I can see some there. But I hope you've enjoyed that, guys. Remember to give us a thumbs up. It's really important and we really appreciate it. And guess what? That's right. We're going to be doing it at the same time again next week as well. Oh, my word, what have we got in store for you then? Can't wait. Literally can't wait. So, thank you so much for joining us this evening, guys. We really do appreciate it. Instagram, stay where you are, because we're going to go back in the pod. Everybody out on YouTube, if you want to join us, then go on, hit nip onto Instagram, Suarez Art. You can find a link down in the description. We're going to have another tour of the painting, if you want to have a little look at that. Just five or ten minutes afterwards. Okay, fantastic. So, um, I think... If you give that one to me, buddy. We've never done this before, guys. So uh, there we go. Right, I'm back now in the room. There we go. Ada's got hold of Instagram. I've got you got on YouTube. So that's it for tonight's live stream. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And uh, if you have, remember, give us a thumbs up. We hope to see you same time, uh, same place next week. But for now, wherever you are, whoever you're with, and whatever you're doing, we wish you well. And I look forward to seeing you again in seven days' time. But officially... From AD and from myself, we are out of here. And a very good evening to all of you. And good night.